So, the next experiment is uh, go back in ok. So, go back in so this is the server I launched the server lsim select LAN click ok ok choose start topology I am using go back in protocol ok. So, you can see here stop and wait go back and select all this so stop and wait we completed so next one is go back in click go back in ok then create you can see two other client systems are here listed here now so go back in protocol uh, suppose uh, last time I is transferred data from server to client this time I am going to send data from client to server ok uh, sorry uh, server to client ok so I am choosing system 3 ok which is click on system 3 and press file transfer so I am going to send to system 2 ok and now I am going to browse a data I browse a data click ok means how many ok the packet is too much so increase the data size only 4 packets so reduce the data size ok so 25 packets are there now now in go pack and you, you know window concept is there window concept means at a time how much data you are transferring so i am going to select the window as 3 or let's choose it as 5 ok so i choose window size as 5 so 1 2 3 4 5 5 data will be transferring say at a time ok so click ok fine and i am going to transmit the file transmit file transmission started you can see 1 to yellow transmitting 3 transmitting 4 transmitting all the 5 will be in yellow color that means all the 5 data will be transmitting ok and and in this system you can see that 5 data is received ok so 5 data is received like, likewise 5 window will be sending next to 5 now you can see that once acknowledgement is in this particular 5 window is moving ok now this is the 5 so the window is moving 5 5 5 ok during that time ok let me pause it I am going to generate error for example bad packet generate continue what happened 10th packet is lost ok if 10th packet is lost what happens the window slides ok go back in from 10th onwards you can see that 7 8 9 10th packet is lost alright so 10th packet is lost then from 10 onwards you will receive the packet go back and means go to the error position it will send uh, data from 10 uh, 10 onwards ok so you won't receive any 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 data after 10 ok but up to 1 to 9 the data is received and 10th packet is lost now you can see here some error happens I think yeah it is stuck the transmission is stuck ok it is not going on ok so the concept is that if you generate an error here in the 10th packet what happened after 1 to 9 the window is coming from 10 11 12 13 14 next to 5 it will transmit likewise it will go back to the error position and retransmit all the data ok this is happening in stop and wait so the procedure for stop and wait go back in and selective repeat will be same so during the setup phase you need to choose the protocol accordingly and for go back in and selective repeat you need to choose the window size ok that is the only difference ok I will show you the video regarding this ok you can do this in the lab once you come to college, okay? Fine.